Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today I will show you guys five different ways to call a phone number directly from the lock screen of your device. Whether you have a phone number that you need to call frequently or, some, or someone that's really important and you have to have it on basically your speed dial, you can have your numbers right there on the lock screen so you can quickly call them without even having to unlock your device or go into the phone app. Now before we get into all that, I just want to ask you guys for a really quick favor. Most of you guys that watch my videos are currently not subscribed to the channel. So if you enjoy the videos and you want to see more of them, please make sure to hit the subscribe button. It will really help the channel a lot. Now, the first one will be pretty obvious. You can just use Siri to call any phone number you want on your iOS device. And that's pretty simple. Of course, you can use the Siri word to invoke it or you can use the side button. Call Apple. And just like that, you can go ahead and call any phone number you want directly from the lock screen of your device by, of course, just using Siri. But we have some other methods that are actually pretty cool and very useful as well. Now, let me show you guys the other one here. Now, for this next method, you will need to use the Shortcuts app and create a shortcut. It's pretty simple. You tap right there to add a new shortcut and just go ahead and search for call. So when you find call, all you have to do here is just tap where it says contact and choose the contact you want to call. Once you have done that, you can go ahead and rename right here the shortcut. You can rename it to that contact. And there we have it. It's now done. Now what you can do is head on to your lock screen. On the lock screen, go to the customization section and tap on customize. Once you go here, you can remove one of the toggles that we have on the lock screen. If you want to have two contacts, then you can remove two of them and tap the plus button and add this one right here where it says run shortcut. If you don't see it right there at the top, make sure you search it right there. So let's just go ahead and add that and then tap choose. And now we can just go ahead and choose the contact that we have just created on the shortcuts app. Once we have done that, just go ahead and tap on the done button and we're good to go. As you can see right now, we have a button right there that basically allows us to call that contact directly from the lock screen. And just like that, you will be able to make the call. Of course, you will need to identify with your face ID there. And just like that, it will start making the call once you have it confirmed right here. As easy as that, you will be able to call any phone number directly from there. The next one will be using an app called Speed Dial. Now with Speed Dial, you will have two different methods that you can use. Something that we have probably forgotten about on iOS is this part right here. On the left side, we have a totally blank page where we can add different widgets. In this case, we can add these widgets from this app and call any phone number we need. And we can use it on the lock screen as well, which is really awesome. So you add the widget, tap and hold there, go to edit widget, and then go ahead and choose the layout here. You can customize it, then choose the phone or email, and then go to action and choose what you want to do call by phone, but you will also have other options as well, which is really awesome. Now, once you have set this up, then you're good to go. You can see we have that widget there. And if you're on the lock screen, all you have to do here to make a phone call is just go ahead and swipe right here. And there you go. You will have the widget with your contact right there. And of course, you can have a full page with a ton of different widgets, which is with a ton of different contacts, which you can actually call directly from here. Now that part right there, the widgets page, which was the original widgets on iOS is actually really awesome. I really love it. But of course, now with the widgets on the home screen, it seems like everyone has forgotten about that section and no one uses it anymore. But it's actually pretty useful as it one just occupy your home screen with widgets you will have all the widgets in one page like this here and even from the lock screen you can go ahead and call any phone number you want now with speed dial you will be able to also have the lock screen widgets not just the widgets on the side here on the home or on the home screen but right here as well so tap on add widgets and just go ahead and find speed dial so once you find speed dial, you tap right there and you go ahead and add a widget. Once you have added that widget, just tap on it. It will show you the list of your contacts 
from here, pick your contact and you're good to go. You will be able to now call that number directly from the lock screen. Now right here, we'll have the contact. You can choose the address, basically which number you want to use to call them. And then of course the connection here as well. Once you have done all of that, then tap the done button and there you go. You will have your contact right there and be able of course to just use right here the widget on the lock screen to go ahead and make the call. Now in this case, I have two phone numbers. So it will first ask me which number I want to use. But again, I can go ahead and make the phone call directly from there. And last but not least will be the action button. If you have a phone with an action button, you can use the shortcuts to actually call any phone number, not just from the lock screen, but from anywhere on your device by using the action button. And it's pretty easy. Again, you will need to create a shortcut with the phone number you want to call. So on the shortcuts app, again, you can just simply tap the plus button, choose the call action. And then from here, simply tap on contacts and pick the contact you want to call and you're good to go. You have now created that shortcut. Now, what you need to do is head on to your settings, go under action button and here find the shortcut section. So you will find right here towards the end that will be here. It is the shortcuts and we can tap on choose shortcut and that allows us to pick the shortcut we have created. And then of course, use uh, that shortcut to call that phone number. And of course it works from the lock screen as well. Simply press and hold here the action button and you will be able to call that phone number directly from the lock screen. So that's basically it for this video, guys. These are five different ways that you can use on your iPhone on iOS 26, or of course, even older iOS versions to make a phone call directly from the lock screen of your device. Whether that's a phone number that you need to call many times a day, or maybe a phone number that is really important and you want to have it right there on your lock screen, you can use any of these five different methods, whichever you prefer, whichever one that you think suits you the best to actually make a phone call directly from the lock screen without having to even unlock your device or go to the phone app or the, to the contacts app and try to find that contact. You can just do it in one of these five ways and it's really cool. As you can see with the widgets that I show you guys, you can even pick like if you want to call like the phone or maybe any of these social apps or FaceTime, you can just pick anything you want and make the phone call that you need. So that is it. Thank you guys for watching the video. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. And of course, don't forget to subscribe for more videos as it really helps the channel a lot. And I will see you guys on the next one.